Welcome. Okay, let's start. What does Festina Lente mean? Festina Lente is a Latin motto created under Emperor Augustus. It means make haste slowly, run slowly. And under him, a series of gold coins were issued with the image of a crab and a butterfly to signify this paradox of rushing slowly. Augustus wasn't the only one who loved this motto. Aldo Manunzio, printer in Venice, loved it too. And the symbol for him was a dolphin wrapped around an anchor. During the Renaissance in Florence, the Medici family loved it too. But their symbol was a turtle with a sail. But let's go back to the crab and a butterfly. The crab represents that part of us that is more careful, maybe the part where we second guess ourselves, but at the same time, the way we are determined and perfectionists. The butterfly is the beauty of imagination. It's our ambition, urgency, even chaos, maybe. And this is what the wisdom of ancient Rome tells us, to be both, to be that paradox, to be the crab and a butterfly. It tells us to run slowly. I love it because I am a lot of festina and very little lente. And I thought, if I have this motto in front of me every day, my life would be better. I can benefit from the contrast, from this paradox. And so the name of the company started this way. When it came time to write out logo, I thought I would ask my mother. My mother has always been creative. She graduated in fine arts in Naples. And she was an art history teacher for a long time in high school. And we decided together to create a sort of a crest. The motto inspires everything that I do and everything that we do here. We have a saying, we say that Festina Lente means have a purpose, but don't rush. Have an ambition, but keep your feet on the ground. Do things well, and enjoy them. And that's what we try to do here. I started this company in 2017. I lived in New York at the time. And I've always been fascinated by the sense of smell. You need a sort of a poem to describe a scent. Even if it is a bad smell, you still have to explain it, to describe it with a metaphor. And and it connects us to our emotions and our memories. So I was pregnant at the time and I started to experiment with candles and with perfumes. Right from the beginning, it was important that all the ingredients that I used were non-toxic because I didn't want to harm my child who was now almost six and his older brother who is now almost eight. When I relocated with my family back to my country, to Italy, we relocated in Milan and loved, I love Milan. I love how similar to New York in a way it is, but it has a, a different vibe, more quiet in a way. When it was time to decide the name of the business, I went back to one of my passions, ancient history. I graduated in ancient history in college and it's part of my DNA. Um, Italians were ancient Romans and though although Romans were famous for their military tactics, their architecture, building an enormous empire, they also left us incredible mottos and way of saying things that you'll find in everyday life. One of them is Festina Lente. That's why I chose Christina Lente as the name of the business, because that's an inspiration for me. Through the process of becoming an artisan, I learned to take things slowly, to make things precisely. And this is what an artisan is. You also need to experiment a lot. I made many mistakes, and some of them I felt ashamed of. And then I realized they were a mistake, they were actually inventions. And that, one of them, for example, is the fact that our diffusers don't have alcohol. It's great to be an artisan because it's also a way to be an innovator. Mm -hmm. 
Living abroad, I realized how much Italy is appreciated in the world. We as Italian don't, don't, don't get it. We don't know that the rest of the world really loves us, appreciates our food, our culture, our country. Among the many things that I did in New York at the time, I was a copywriter for Artemist, which is a marketplace that sells high artisanal, made in Italy objects to the world. And it really hit me back then, describing every day the world of these artisans, how the made in Italy, the craftsmanship that has been refined for centuries, is really Italy's heritage. It's what we give to the world. And be part of that tradition, be part of that world is incredible.